deficit for the New York Knicks. They work the ball inside. Keep feeding your big dogs down low. Roof, roof, roof. Good things will happen. Spoken like a guy who made a career out of living in that paint. Recognize the Player of the Month Award recipients. The selection for the Western Conference, Ja Morant. Well, Ja Morant has certainly been one of the most exciting guys to watch. The athleticism, are you kidding me? Never passes up an opportunity for a big play. But also does the other stuff. Control the pace, run the offense. He's the complete package. Appreciate you joining us. It's been our distinct pleasure, and I mean that. Let's now take you back over to the third quarter with Brian Anderson. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been a fairly even one. Boy, it's been quite a game for Mitchell Robinson. He's factored into their game plan in a big way tonight. He's been a key guy. This is why you prepare. Get ready for the opportunity if it comes your way, because you may be asked to deliver. And Atlanta, looking at who they've got. Nas Reed out there with Kristaps Porzingis. Then there's Devin Booker. Then there's Devontae Graham. And it's Harris in at the three slot. Now here's Paul to the inside. Here's Hayward. It's good. The assist that time from Paul. Paul's got his seventh assist here tonight. Working over that in-between area. Gordon Hayward with the size and skills to get it done. Pass to Booker from outside the arc. It's rebounded by New York. Well, so far, this cold night from the field has not affected their ability to maintain this lead. Now Paul. Picked by Gobert. Paul passes to Gobert. And it's good for two. Gobert's got ten points in the game. CP3 is a nightmare in pick and roll situation. The Hawks leading. Outside Graham. Harris on the wing. And that's up and in. Five for 12 in this game. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. Now here's Paul. Screen by Horford. Oh, it's blocked by Porzingis. The Hawks have gone just one of three in the second half. Outside Booker. Porzingis with a screen on Thompson. Just five on the clock. For three, Booker. That shot off the mark. And New York will come the other way. Shaky start to the half. Going one for four. Still trying to find that groove. Horford against Porzingis. Hayward left side. On the money with a shot from the left block. Hayward's got his second basket on the night. You see, this is where the size of Hayward makes a difference. He's very comfortable working inside. For three, Booker. It's rebounded by New York. Horford's got rebound number seven tonight. For the lead. The rebound by the Hawks. Harris has got four rebounds in the game. Ball against Graham. Porzingis with a screen on Hayward. They kick it out to Porzingis. Oh, the Hawks again cannot hit it. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Hayward to pass to Paul. Back to Hayward. Pass to Thompson. That one's good, and it's Hayward with the setup. Thompson's got his first points of the game. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Graham against Paul. For three. Oh, 
Oh, the Hawks again cannot hit it. It's a shot you would think he would make. He just doesn't make it all the time. Gobert up top. Graham against Paul. Over Graham. Stolen by Reed. Down low. Here's Porzingis. Shoots over Paul. It counts. And the foul. It goes on Chris Paul. Shooting at a high clip. He's found ways to get quality looks. So for the Knicks. Mitchell Robinson. He's checked in for Gobert. Hardaway comes in for Hayward. And it's Kyle Lowry in for Paul. That free throw good from Porzingis. Standing at 7-3. We have never seen a player quite like Kristaps Porzingis. A fantastic shooter, a solid ball handler. What a talent. Now here's Horford. Six points for him. Back to Lowry. This one for three. And no good. So Atlanta will take it the other way. They'll be playing host to New Orleans for their next one. That game marks the start of a four-game homestand for the club. Pass to Porzingis. Shoots over Horford. Porzingis misses. The Knicks have gone four of eight in the third. Lowry, the pass to Horford. Here's Robinson. He's checked by Carter. Hardaway with it. The 15-footer. And again, the Knicks missing. Decent look for mid-range, but there may have been a better option for them in that set. Here's Caldwell Pope. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. It's going to go on Mitchell Robinson. Man, yeah, good whistle there. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for Atlanta. They are making it rain from the three-point land right now. And the coaching staff continues to encourage them to let it fly. Well, something else that stands out is how they've shared the ball. I mean, they're getting a lot of their points from sharp passing. And he drops it first. Does not get the second one. New York has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Thompson with it. Now Carter defending. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. The length of Thompson is deceptive. He uses it well to draw fouls inside. Thompson at the line. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Overcoming adversity on the injury front. Klay Thompson's one of the tougher players in this league, both mentally and physically. And so he makes both from the line. The Hawks leading. Now here's Booker. He's got five. Pass to Porzingis. Healed for three. It's hauled in by Robinson. For New York, they've gone four of nine in the third quarter. And here's Lowry. Outside Robinson. And here's Thompson for three. Fires in the triple. Thompson's got seven points. Woo, what range from Clay Thompson. It's insane. Combine that with his confidence, it's a lethal concoction. Here's Caldwell Pope. Over Hardaway. Caldwell Pope's shot is off. 
New York has gone only one of three from deep here in the third. Hard away with it. Lowry left side. From deep three-point range. The rebound by Carter. Carter's got five rebounds tonight. Booker, the pass to Heald. Outside Porzingis. Pass to Booker. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's the three. Gets the three ball to go. Give him eight points now. It's enough to where you have to respect him. Had one triple in the first half. Now has his second. Time called here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. making a change here. Bogdanovich has checked in. Kevin Love's checked in for Atlanta. Hayes comes in for Devin Booker. left side outside Bogdanovich and the Knicks miss again you know we talk a lot about scoring efficiency he's displaying the exact opposite and here's Hayes now quiet so far offensively searching for his first point of the game just four to shoot. The offensive rebound. And that one good. And now a three-point Hawks lead. Right there, Carter using his instincts and motor to track down the miss and convert into second-chance points. Now here's Hardaway. Fires the three. Rebounded by Heald. <laughs> Just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. Here's Hayes. Love, a screen on Lowry. Hayes for three. It's rebounded by New York. Robinson's got nine rebounds now. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. And a big finish by Robinson. <laughs> a beautiful setup on the alley-oop. Great catch, great flush. Hayes against Lowry. Hayes, the pass to Love. Back to Hayes. The Hawks need to get one up here. And a miss there on the triple. Just enough of a shot contest to bother him. Hayes against Lowry. Here's Robinson. And a big finish by Robinson. Here in the second half, this game still nip and tuck. Just an insane amount of lead changes. The fans are getting their money's worth. Love, a screen on Lowry. Right side, Love. Launches a three. Sends it home. From 
from three-point land. Love's got 10 points in the game. Watching Hayes, he keeps his eyes up, always looking for a better shot, either for himself or his teammates. Back to Lowry. Bogdanovich on the wing. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. And the Hawks shooting a low 29% since halftime. Pass to Love. Now here's Heal, defended by Bogdanovich. For three, Hardaway drills it from deep. And the Knicks lead by one. You like how easily Bogdanovich shares the ball, doesn't try to do it all by himself. Over to the wing. Love against Horford. Back to Hayes. Pass to Caldwell Pope. Healed for three. Another three for Atlanta. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Here's Robinson. Now Hardaway. Screen by Robinson. Hardaway with it. Now Carter defending. Hardaway, no good. That's two points they should have had. I'm sure he'd love to get that look again. Pass to Love. Carter with it. He's guarded by Lowry. From down low, it's hauled in by Robinson. Robinson's got rebound number 11. Hardaway up top. He's defended by Hayes. Back to Hardaway. Lowry, right side. Screen by Robinson from about 19. The rebound by Carter. Carter's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Hayes, the pass to Heald. Outside low. The three. It's rebounded by New York. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Hardaway against Heald. That went off the back iron and out. He just couldn't finish the job that time. And too bad, because it was a nice look. Takes a 13-footer. It's rebounded by New York. Horford's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Hardaway, the pass to Lowry. Over Hayes. And the Knicks miss again. I love Kyle Lowry's commitment at the defensive end of the floor. He's a hard-nosed player. We're at the end of the third quarter, and we've still got a close one. Hawks ahead. They lead by a bucket. And time to step away quickly, but we'll be back in no time with the start of the fourth quarter. It's time to bring up the State Farm Assist to the game. And I'll tell you what, this was a no-brainer tonight. Take a look at the precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. This is why you preach teamwork. Some of the most spectacular plays are the ones where guys are feeding off one another. And it's been a very competitive game so far as we get rolling here in quarter number four. They've got Rudy Gobert. Bogdan Bogdanovich is out there with Gordon Hayward. Then it's Clay Thompson. And it's Paul in at the point guard position. That's the five for New York right now. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Booker finds Harris. Outside for Zingas. Pass to Booker. There's the three. And Porzingis gets it to go on the assist from Booker. Booker's got four assists now tonight. New York trailing. Outside Paul. Bogdanovich with it. Now here's Thompson. Booker defending. From ten feet away. Thompson shot is off. The struggle is real. He's been way off with this shot all evening long. Pass to Booker. Up top.
Top read defended by Gobert. Shot from 12. It's rebounded by New York. Gobert's got a rebound number 12 here already in the game. We've gone about a minute and a half into this fourth quarter. And he lobs it up. Oh, and Gobert powers it home. A beautiful setup on the alley-oop. Great catch, great flush. Thompson against Booker. Shoots over Thompson. The shot misses. The Knicks go the other way with it. I've been in this position. Your team is up. You want to drive in the dagger. He may be a little overeager. Gobert against Booker. Hayward outside. Thompson, a screen on Reed. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's an area where Hayward has really improved. Earning trips to the line. Gordon Hayward at the line. Two shots. Free throw good from Hayward. And what I appreciate about Gordon is he's a fighter. Working his way back from that devastating leg injury in 2017. Still a solid contributor. That one falls. So he hits both of them. For Atlanta, they've gotten just one shot to fall out of three attempts in the fourth. Pass to Booker. Reed with it. Fourth quarter play. We're about two and a half minutes through it now. What timing from Rudy. He is superb at measuring when to go after blocks. Now here's Paul. Now Gobert. Here's Thompson to take the lead. Sinks it from distance. Thompson's got 10 points in just the second half. That's a terrific read by Gobert, understanding the offensive end better and better, especially as of late. Now here's Grant. Outside Booker to halt the run. And that one's good with extra effort on the glass. A really nice play by Booker. I mean, he gives you size out of the backcourt and can finish with either hand. Hayward, the pass to Paul. Gobert with a screen on Graham. Pass to Bogdanovich. Yes, and it's Paul with the assist that time. The confidence of Bogdanovich from down in the corner. He knows he has that shot. Graham, the pass to Reed. Here's Booker. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Rudy Gobert picks one up. All right, guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Knicks. Smart ball handling from them in this one. Passing around to get ahead of the defense and putting it in the hands of ready Take shooters. They're also doing a good job working the ball inside tonight. The defense has been struggling to slow them down there in the paint. That free throw good from Booker. Already a terrific career for Booker. Three-time All-Star, and then last year he was named to the All-NBA First Team. Just a big honor. The Knicks making a switch here. Orford's checked in. Both free throws good from Booker. And with Booker, it's not just the scoring. Grant, he does a little bit of everything. Hey, B.A., I mean, you go back and look at last season. He had career highs in rebounds, steals, blocks. I mean, he's learned how to affect the game, even when his shot isn't falling, which is rare. Pass to Graham. 
Back to Harris. Good. And the Hawks lead by one. So flexible at the offensive end. Harris has a number of go-to moves, and they've added up to a big night. Now here's Gobert. Now Paul. Graham covering. Rebounded by the Hawks. And see, he had his momentum going forward, but really didn't need to lean in there. He was wide open. Pass to Reed. And a great assist by Graham as that one goes. Graham's got seven assists in the game. New York has gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. Here's Paul. Out to Thompson. Let's it go from deep. And it's Graham with the rebound. The Hawks have gotten four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. To the paint. Harris' shot is good. Harris has got four points now in the quarter. Nice bucket. The polished inside game. Something Harris relies on. Looking to win the run. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. And we've seen some good free throw shooting in the second half. At the line, two shots. First free throw is good. An experienced veteran in this league, Chris Paul offers valuable insight both on and off the floor. Paul hits them both. For Atlanta, they've got five out of ten shots to drop here in the final quarter. Now Graham. Porzingis with a screen on Paul. Graham for three. And the Hawks with another three. We know Graham has this range. He is a pretty confident three-point shooter. Pass to Gobert. And here is Thompson. Booker defending. Thompson passes to Hayward. Picked by Gobert. Four, three. Porzingis grabs the board. Porzingis has got rebound number eight here already in the game. Oh, got that one up quick. And now it's a nine-point Hawks lead. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Time called here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. change here. Carter's checked in. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Hey guys, over the last break I listened to Tom Thibodeau address the team. He's not happy with the amount of threes they've given up. He said, quote, if at least we were sending back some answers, but we're not. So expect a concerted effort to change that one. Guys. Thank you for that, Allie. Hawks on D. They lead by the biggest margin of the game at nine. Now here's Paul. It's Hayward on the wing. New York no good that time either. Outside Grant. Pass to Booker. Off target. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. New York has got two of five threes to go here in the fourth. Booker 
against Thompson. And there's the call on Devin Booker. That's his first foul. And that shot was going nowhere thanks to that aggressive swat. Oh, my, oh, my. And that was textbook defense positioning himself well to send it back. Thompson outside. Five to shoot. And after just a fantastic first half, he's really having trouble finding that shooting stroke. Pass to Paul. Clock at six. Shoots from the line. Great timing on the defensive end. Devontae Graham doing a solid job and making a difference. Just a big play at this juncture of the game. Second chance points could be the key for them. Impressive effort right there. That's what they need to mount a comeback. Time called here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. to Booker lets the three fly it's hauled in by Hayward Hayward's got his eighth rebound here tonight they've been having major problems offensively definitely in a bit of a dry spell he's looked like a totally different player in the second half that's his third triple now here's Booker nice D from Thompson and the truth is I've been there he's trying to find the rhythm on his shot he feels like he's close, and that's why he keeps shooting. Paul with it, and it's Graham picking him up from deep. Hayward, yes, and it's Paul with the assist that time. Paul's got his assist totals piling up. 11 now for him tonight. Atlanta's got three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. Graham, the pass to Porzingis. Harris down low, guarded by Hayward. Harris misses. That's their plan to get him an opportunity to finish in tight. That's a miss they can live with. Here's Paul. And too long on the shot. The Hawks have gotten seven of 16 attempts to drop since the start of the fourth. Horford with a steal. Hayward against Harris. To take the lead. With the second effort, ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. That one on Harris. Love to see Gordon Hayward shake things up and get busy down inside. The defense really doesn't know what to do when he's down there other than hack him. Ties it up, and his next one could give him the lead. And the free throw is good. Now leading by one. See, now he's getting defenders back on their heels a little bit. Getting to the foul line here in the second half. Now a timeout called by Atlanta. And Atlanta shooting just 38% for this game so far. Pass to Carter. To the inside. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. Rudy Gobert picks one up. This is what Carter's built to do. Attack on the interior and impose his will. Two shots. Oh. 
Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Falls for Carter. He's perfect from the line this time. Because he knows he makes a living at the line, he invites contact and sometimes even initiates it. Pass to Gobert. Thompson with it. Shoots over Booker. And it's Thompson that time on the assist from Gobert. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. 84, 83. The Hawks trailing. Outside Booker. Here's Harris, guarded by Hayward. Hayward against Harris. Six to shoot. It's Booker on the wing. Oh, the Hawks again cannot hit it. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. Pass to Paul. Throws it up high. Go for a lob there. Excellent defense and anticipation to stop it. Graham against Paul. Here's Porzingis. The shot, no good. Now the Knicks take it the other way. And here's New York now. They've got a 12-2 run in progress. Thompson passes to Paul. Horford, a screen on Graham. Six on the shot clock. Horford can't hit. Atlanta's gone three for five from three-point land since the end of the third quarter. Harris misses. New York has gone four of eight from three-point land during the fourth. The drive by Paul. Stolen by Carter. Graham against Paul. Graham, the pass to Carter. Now here's Booker. to Graham. From deep. No good on the shot. New York goes the other way with it. Outside Paul. Tries a 10-footer. Misses off the left iron. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Here's Graham. And it's good. There is absolutely no fear in his eyes. He loves the moment. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. Now a timeout call by New York. They're down by one. We've got 22 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. All right, guys, what do you think? This is where your coaching is so important. They need a really good play now. These are the plays that people remember. I can't wait to see what he has devised. and finds Paul. The 11-footer. The rebound by Carter. The thing is, you want to do everything you can to help your team. And sometimes you just try to do too much. Getting a little desperate at this stage. I mean, the clock's the big factor. Now a timeout called by Atlanta. They're on top by one. 15 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. This lead is razor thin. Yeah, B.A., and there's a chance to extend that right here. 
fourth team foul. Devontae Brown, at the line, two shots. Shoot two. the first one and that'll put him up too this team likes having Graham on the line he is cool under pressure and so he drops them both and it's a three-point game huge shots tremendous job stepping up in a big way for them at the strike now a timeout called by New York they're down by three there's 14 seconds left in the fourth and finds Hayward from deep. Off target from downtown. Stepping up big. Gobert showing why he's considered a cornerstone for this franchise. And they foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. Two shots. Good on the first, and that'll put him up too. You know, Graham's game is all about a mix of pace and focus. He plays at a high tempo, but doesn't rush things. It's impressive. And a tough break as his second attempt is... No good at the line. Here's Paul. Oh, he had a chance there to send it to OT, but they come up empty-handed. So it's a narrow victory for the Hawks, pulling it out for the W. With the late victory, they upset plenty of these hometown fans. They really should take this win to heart. When the pressure was on, they stepped up and worked twice as hard to overcome it. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's Allie, thank you as always. And that's going to do it tonight, folks.